are behind the scenes once again at the WNC Chefs Challenge competitions and this week's battle is between the Admiral in West Asheville and the Sunset Terrace from the Grove Park Inn. And this week both restaurants are battling over bacon. I think everyone is very excited about this one. So we're going to go in the back and talk to the chefs and see what they think about this battle of bacon. We have Steven Sauer here from the Grove Park Inn, the Sunset Terrace, and how do you feel about Battle Bacon? I think this is the best thing could have happened. I mean, bacon, uh, I was actually hoping for country ham, and we got bacon, which is close relative. It's just smoked, um, just as much flavor. So I'm, I'm really, I'm stoked about it. Like, it couldn't, couldn't be a better battle, actually. All right, we're here with Drew Maycuth, and he is part of Team Admiral. And I have a feeling you guys are kind of excited about Battle Bacon. We like bacon. Uh, I feel like we use a lot, a lot of bacon at that restaurant. We uh, actually forgot bacon today, so we were allowed to bring a few extra ingredients, and uh, we were pretty bummed out. And then we showed up, and there was like 20 pounds of bacon for us to use. So we were stoked on that. And I finally just got a piece of bacon. Oh my god. I can definitely taste the smokiness of it in the soup, in the actual soup base itself. But the texture of the bacon is just great. It's real nice and crispy. It's got a great texture to it when you bite into it. There's a nice little explosion of bacon flavor. I'm a little bit of a bacon fan. And I think I'm going to be kind of freaking out all night. <laughs> So we have a visitor, our friend Ryan Kelly stopped by to tell us what she, well, she didn't know she was stopping by to tell us what she thought about the pancetta dish, but uh, she's offered to share her thoughts, and what do you think? Well, I really appreciated the spinach salad portion. I thought that the vinaigrette on it was delicious. However, the pancetta itself was disappointing. My pieces were very fattening and had a very um, thick texture that wasn't palatable. Um, I like the watermelon terrain. I thought that was very creative. But the flavoring, there were points where I got a lot of spice. It wasn't a consistent um, spice texture. So overall, not my favorite so far, but I appreciated the creativity. The, the pork is like butter. It's very tender. The shallots are, are, it looks like they're maybe tossed in a little flour, they're, they're fried, so they're really crispy. The shrimp is cooked perfect, the egg nice and creamy, the broth itself has so much flavor, it's got, it's got spice, it's, um, it's, it's thick, the color's right, um, it's, a, it's a fantastic dish. It's, uh, it's pretty simple. I think last time we started screwed ourselves because we put way too many components on everything. Uh, this is our simple one. It's mashed potatoes with vegetables. The cool thing is the chicken, you break it down, there's a dark meat stuffed in the middle of the chicken, then there's a breast meat wrapped around that, then there's a bacon wrapped around that with meat glue, and then there's chicken skin wrapped around the bacon with meat glue. It's sort of cool. People will eat it and they won't really think anything about it. They're like, oh, there's bacon in my chicken. But uh, I think it's sort of a crazy technique. I think it's gone really well. Um, all the dishes that we've done have pretty much gone to plan. Um, we're working as a team. Uh, I think that our opponents have really good dishes as well. I, I don't know. I, I, just, uh, I just wish we had more of the same uh, China. There's not enough of that. That's what that's what the biggest challenge is right now. It's it's okay. Here's here's my deal. You gotta film this. That is not working. There's there's some sort of alchemy happening on this dish, but it's it's absolutely amazing. Holy crap! I'm in love. 
Let me let me be let me be alone for a minute here. <laughs> All right, so we're here with Bob Bowles, and thank you once again. Another great competition. What do you think of Battle Bacon? Oh, uh, you know, of all the different ingredients we could have chosen for the night, I think this is the one people wanted, but they didn't know it was really going to happen. When the chefs came in and I announced this is Battle Bacon, they just melted with joy. Absolutely. This is the one challenge they really wanted to live up to. And from the ingredients tonight and the plates they put out, they have far surpassed that challenge. The Admiral with 6,696 points. Grove Park Inn with 6,163 points.